assalamu alaikum students i hope everyone is fine and safe so student first of all uh, those student who didn't turn on their cameras kindly and kindly turn it on and mute and mute yourself okay students as you all know that we have started uh, we have done uh, ch uh, till chapter number 1 till 5 so we are having only from chapter number 2 we are having two things left that is task and the brainstorm so in this lecture uh, first we will do a little, uh, we will do a start of chapter number 6 and then there is lot of uh, written work is there so student speedily we have to do our written work as well so first of all we are going to start from the chapter number 6 that are the parts of plants i will explain it teacher teacher aaya hai uske niche tick lagana jiska part of plant azan until unless you are not supposed to unmute yourself until unless i am not saying to you so listen my instructions uh, very carefully students so uh, we are going to start chapter number 6 uh, as our parts of the plants so first of all i am going to give the explanation then we will do reading so uh, here is a parts of plants as you have seen there are lot in our world in our surroundings we have seen different types of plants some plants are very big some are very small some are having few uh, branches few uh, branches means uh, branches also we can say that the stems some plants are having very uh, small stems or branches some are having many branches so they are spread out widely so these plants we can see they are always in the different shapes we can see in this picture you can see each and every plant leaf is different to one another and they all are different in sizes as well some are big you have seen into your screen some are very small that uh, is visible into your screen so similarly that there is a difference in leaves similarly we cannot get the same flower from every plant there are many different flowers in the world and we eat lot of different fruits and vegetables that we get from these plants so these all uh, these all are the basic differences of a plant again i am repeating that they are uh, some plants are big or small some are having many branches or stems and they are having different shapes of leaf you can see each, in this picture each of these plants their leaves are different to another some leaves are very big some are very small some are flat and long some are very thin and long so these are the different shapes of the leaves you have seen uh, clearly on your screens then um, we can get different fruits and flowers from the plants these are the differences so what are the similarities now what is the similar in between these plants these the similarity is that all the plants can having roots the stem the flowers leaves and fruits but we can get different flowers fruits and leaves but they, they all the plant contains these parts of plants that are a uh, fruit flower stem leaf root in every plant these basic parts are there so um, the function of these parts are different these all parts uh, parts work different as you all know that uh, fruit uh, flower turns into the fruit and the function of leaf is to make food stem give the support to the uh, plant and uh, also transport water and food to the uh, plant the function of root is to uh, absorb water from the ground from the soil and the fruit is um, fleshy and sweet and we get uh, there are seed inside the fruit so seed has ability to produce a new plant so these are the basic functions of the plant which i explain you and uh, uh, moving forward next that are the parts of plant in this picture you can see the plant is divided into two main parts the first part is known as the root second part is known as a shoot so what is the root the part 
here you can see these are the roots of the plant that is under the soil under the ground so the function of the root is to absorb water and minerals from the ground so the uh, the parts of the plant which is under the soil or under the ground is known as the root system so the part of the plant which is above the soil here is a soil layer of soil you can see very clearly so the part of the plant which is above above the soil is known as the shoot system so all the parts of the plant like flower leaf fruit stems buds so these are uh, all are the all the parts are uh, collectively comes into the shoot system only in the root system the roots are coming but in the shoot system rest all of the parts of the plant like stems fruit leaf and the flower they all are come into the shoot system so uh, plants are divided into two main part that is first one is root and second one is shoot system these two are the basic parts of the plant so student till yet uh, we are having the explanation so moving forward to your warm up that is on page number 39 make a pencil uh, take a pencil in your own hands and you can see clearly that uh, take the correct picture of each pair each pair is means to say that you have to see how the plants will grow how they are having the correct pictures first one is that we can see this mangoes were growing like this in a stem or in this picture so the in these two pairs the first pair is the correct one you are going to make a tick on the first pair on this other hand the second picture the picture of the leaves as you all know that leaves uh, uh, grows on the shoot system not in the roots so this picture is wrong and this picture is correct Ru uh, leaves always grows on the shoot system shoot system is that system which is, um, where uh, that the parts of this plant will grow above the soil so next third one is that this is a picture of a shrub in shrub there are many branches they are not having a single branch so this is the cross and this picture is a correct you can make a tick on here and the last one you can see the creepers so the creepers always grow along the ground and they are having one on one stem one uh, plant uh, grow on one stem so this is a correct picture and this is a wrong one yes student do it fastly teacher i have done okay asan so moving forward okay okay students now we are moving forward to the teacher one minute teacher one minute teacher done okay Okay, students. So now reading is going to be start by Isha Yasir. That is on page number thirty-nine, below the warm-up. <sighs> yes, Isha, continue. <laughs> students as we have to uh, written work as well so isha please continue reading from page number 30 39 below warm up warm up ki picture ke niche se isha there are many different plants around the some plants are big some are small some plants have many branches some do not have branches at all their leaf has different shape their flower and fruit are different there there are many different in their appearance but they are all did he the word is appearance 
appearance, but there are also many similarities. Similarities more Simi than we see. Most plants we see around us have roots, stems, leaves, flower, and fruit. These are the important plant part. Important part of also the all these. Part work together and help the plant to sur survive. Thank you, Isha. Survive. So next student, so next student who is going to continue from the page number forty is Abdullah. Yes, Abdullah, kindly unmute yourself and. Let's look at the different parts of a plant. A plant has two main parts: the root, uh, the shoot. The part of the plant which grows under the ground is called the root. The part of the plant which grows ab above, above, the, uh, ab above. The ground is called the shoot. The shoot has stem, stems, branches, no, leaves, no, stems, 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 branches, leaves, burn, flowers, flowers and fruits. Okay, till yet we are going to read today, and from the previous chapter we are left. So, student, now open the page number thirty-seven of your books. We have tomorrow. We have left the task. Seven. So now you can see yes, thirty-seven. Now you can see clearly on your screen that there is page number on page number thirty-seven. This is a task that what you have to do in it. You have to read each paragraph, choose a picture from the books, and write the word to show how each person feel, how they are feel in the different situations. So situations, different situations are given there. In first pictures, you can look at your own books. The first one that is on page number thirty-seven is that Fatima and Abida are sisters. They love each other. Fatima moved far away for her studies. How does Abida feel? So in this story, in this situation, they have two sisters and two brothers. वो एक दूसरे को बहुत से ना एक दूसरे से बहुत प्यार करती हैं लेकिन फातमा अपनी स्टडी के सिलसिले में बाहर चली गई है तो आपदा को कैसा फील होगा आईदर शी फील हैप्पी सरप्राइज सैड और एंग्री सैड यस आपदा फील सैड सो यू आर गोइंग टू राइट डाउन सैड देयर यस नाइट बिफोर हर बर्थडे पार्टी How does Uzma feel? अब Uzma को है उसको रात को नींद नहीं आ रही क्यों नहीं आ रही क्योंकि उसकी वो बर्थडे पार्टी से पहले वाली नाइट है उसकी मतलब कल साल घर है और उसकी आज की वो रात को सो नहीं रखती तो उसकी वजह से उसमा कैसा फील कर रही है हैप्पी सरप्राइज सैड और एंग्री यश जी हाँ सरप्राइज यस सरप्राइज शी फील सरप्राइज एंड राइट ऑन सरप्राइज 
I let me just do P R I. So the third situation is that Ali let his little brother take his carry-ons to school. His brother lost his carry-ons. How does Ali feel? Angry. So, angry. Yes. Angry. 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 You can write angry on it. And the last one, last task is that Sana plucked some flowers and gave them to her teacher. Her teacher smiled at her. How does Sana feel? Happy. Yes, happy. You can write these all situations. And those students who have done till yet, they can take out your copies. Take out your copies, everyone. Teacher, yes, write your copies pages, mention date and day on it. Chapter number, teacher. Five. Teacher. Yes. Notes was given to you for that. Teacher, I paid Zayan, your name is Zayan? Yes. Okay, Zayan, I will inform to the school so you will get the notes. Four or five. You or B, 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 Okay, okay. Wrong question, then B part case. Question number four and five. Okay, Zayan, I will inform to the school. You will get the note soon of certain number four and five. Okay, so students, those students who have get it, those students who have done it, firstly take out your copies and write your page in the task on the page number 38. There is a brainstorm. Wait a minute, Samaha. Yes, Samaha, now you can say what you want to say. Students, kindly don't uh, unmute yourself. I am going to say you to unmute it because there is little, uh, so me, much. This, uh, I can't there see is so much. <sighs> Dania, what you can't hear? Teacher, I can't hear you. What you can't hear? I said that. Dan Dania, kindly do uh, reconnect your net so you can hear me properly. Uh, there, uh, sometimes there is a little work network okay, issue, so uh, that's why you can't hear me properly. Yes, Amaha, you want to ask something? So, Fasi said. Teacher, I am right here and there. Okay. Uh, Students, so here is on page number 38. There is a brainstorm. You are going to do it on your copy. That brainstorm is that this is a question that write three similarities and three differences between a rose plant and a rabbit. So, here is the answer. Similarly, like I have done on this word page, you are going to make a difference line. Here is the differentiate line. You are going to write down the question first. Ready your pages, the chapter number five. Brain, it's a brainstorm question that write three similarities. Similarities means that what kind of three things are that rose plant me bhi hain aur rabbit ki bhi milti hain aapas mein. Aur differences kehte hain ki unme fark kaun kaun se aata hai, kahan kahan pe wo ek dusre se different nazar aate hain. So first, uh, start doing it. On your copies, yes, who is there? Isha. Yes, Isha. Teacher, how do you do it? Teacher, which page are you on? Which page are you on? You are going to do it on your copies. You have to do it on your copies. Okay. Alright, Samaha, you already no. i said that those students who have done no. it take out the copies ready chapter number five and then start doing it on your copies first you mention 
uh, class work date and day and then chapter number five that is living and non-living things then write down the question that was visible on your screen that write three similarities and differences between a rabbit and a rose plant students we are having only i think so uh 19 minutes so in 19 minutes you are going to complete this question miss i have done my uh, five chapters and you have done this question as well brainstorm yes so you can recheck it uh, okay, you can tell us what you have written in the similarities between a rose plant and a rabbit. You can look towards your copy, Imtishal, or okay. 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 Did you know I have done my five chapters on copy? But this is a question of five chapter, M. Tishal. Did you add many? Six yes, you are missing. No, this is not the sixth chapter. This is chapter number five. This question was written on page number 38. You can open your book, Imtishal, and see on page number 38 of your science book. There is a brainstorm. Brainstorm was written. Ye jo abhi humne task kiya na, iske niche hi brainstorm likha hua. Uska ye question na, ye notes mein aap logo ko nahi mila hai. Okay. Teacher. Yes, Isha. Teacher, so here, WhatsApp send kar sakti hai, sare. Miss, kya homo copy pe karna hai? Yes. Yes, in the shawl. Isha, try to do is in these 19 minutes. Now we are having only 16 Teacher, minutes over there. Teacher, I will do this in the lead. Okay, good okay, I'm trying to send it to the word, uh, WhatsApp as well. So here is the uh, first difference, the similarity is that rabbits need water and food and also rose plant need water and food. The second similarity is both need the sunlight. Why they need the sunlight? Plants need sunlight to grow. And while rabbits need sunlight as our bones need vitamin D and we need lots of vitamin from the sunlight. These vitamin D helps a rabbit to grow fast. Is the rabbits ki jo bones and wo grow fastly grow kati and that's why they both need the sunlight. So they both can grow. They both can become bigger in size after uh, some uh, after few months. So they both can grow bigger. So next, I'm uh, moving forward to the differences. Students, I hope everyone has written the question. So I am moving first page upward. Here is the answer is visible on your screen. Yes, here is a complete answer. So uh, the difference is that, as you all know that rabbit is an animal while rose is a plant. And we can see rabbit in some colors and we uh, in some colors means we can see rabbit only in white, black and brown color. We cannot see rabbit in pink, green, yellow color. So we can see rabbits in only some colors. And we can see rose plants in many colors like we can see the rose in red color, in yellow color, in pink color, in black color. These are the many different colors. So the last difference is that rabbit cannot make their own food. 
while the rose plant has the ability to make their own food so these are the major differences we are going to note it down on your copies and uh, after that i am going to try it to send you on the whatsapp Students, we are having thirteen minutes left. Shijiha, you are not doing the work. Yes. So from where you can get it, Shijiha, as you all know that soon your copies will be sent to the school. So when you are going to complete it? ये कॉपी चेकिंग करने के लिए स्कूल में आपकी जब कॉपीज आएंगे आपको का तो काम कंप्लीट होना चाहिए व्हेन यू आर गोइंग टू डू इट एक्सक्यूज मी टीचर एट लीस्ट नोट इट डाउन इन सम रफ पेज सो यू कैन कंप्लीट इट लेटर ऑन एक्सक्यूज मी टीचर टीचर ये आपने कौन सा करवा रही हैं दिस इज अ ब्रेनस्टॉर्म दैट इज ऑन पेज नंबर 38 फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर 5 जो अभी मैंने थोड़ी देर पहले टास्क करवाया था जिसमें सरप्राइज हैप्पी और डिफरेंट फीलिंग्स का था। पहले मुझे आवाज नहीं आ रही थी इसलिए ये प्रोजेक्ट आई राइट अ सिमिलर यस दिस इज अ ब्रेन यस दानिया यू गेट द सेम पॉइंट दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन दैट राइट थ्री सिमिलरिटीज एंड थ्री डिफरेंसेस a rabbit and a rose plant this question you are going to write it down on your copy and on your screen the answer is visible students only 11 minutes are left now unko ko ke wo mujhe awaaz nahi aati mujhe awaaz nahi aayi thi pehle isliye okay daniel no problem at all you can do it right now as we are having 11 minutes now now kitne ye jo dikh raha hai wahan pe YouTube पे देख सकती हैं। Yes, this video is recorded and uh, it will soon it will upload on your YouTube channel as well. Okay, thank now, you. Now students, only ten minutes are left, so do your work fastly. Teacher, I'm Samaha Fatma. Yes, Samaha. Teacher, your page number page page number thirty eight जाए. यही नजर आ रहा है एंड यू आर गोइंग ना वो कॉपी पे ही करना ओके ना थैंक यू Samaha have you done it? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Done. done. It. Yes. Okay, Isha. So student this is same this is your homework as well. You are going to learn it. A uh, student uh, any one of you can tell us one similarity there is a between a rabbit and a rose plant and i didn't write it as they have said only to write three similarities any one of you is going to tell me what is the basic major similarity between rabbit and a rose plant i know teacher i know yes. similarity yes teacher the they both can grow and they 
can also i have written grow i said that beside these three points there is a one basic major similarity i didn't write it there so any one of you is going to tell us this basically this similarity is from the chapter name teacher yes mahat they both are living things yes exactly they both are the living things this is a major similarity between them then mom has a charger left banana ha tum karte hai paanch person left hai le banana Isha only Isha and Samaha said they both have done. Students, we are having only seven minutes now. Teacher, I am almost done. Ah, uh, Dania, you said that. Yes. Okay. Maha done it. Teacher, little is left. One is left. Teacher, I'm done. Teacher, I'm done. Who said I have done? Tanya. Go, Tanya. So this is again. I'm saying that this is also your home task that you have to learn it. Excuse me, teacher. Yes, Tanya. Can you upload this video during the break? Uh, I have no idea when it's going to be uploaded. Uh, almost thirty. Uh, side by side, they will upload all of the lectures video. So I am not having any surety that on which time this video is going to be uploaded, Danya. Okay. Good, Mahat. Sir, do it fastly. Teacher done. Good, Mahat. Imtishal, if I'm, you both have done it. Teacher done. Okay, Danial. Okay, you can do it later on then. Yes. Okay. But students, again and again, I am saying that uh, soon. Uh, your copies will be collected so complete your task especially shajiha there is lot of uh, missing work this jiha has told us she didn't do chapter number 2 3 4 and 5 lot of work is there teacher maine apna homework kar liye good students those students like shajiha and uh, uh, someone who doesn't uh, complete their work kindly complete it as soon as possible because your copies will be collected soon do i have you done it you can unmute yourself and then you can say teacher i have done over the chance so done Salar, have you done it? Yeah. Students, only four minutes, three minutes are there now. So complete it. Otherwise, your screen is going to be. Uh, this lecture is going to be end soon.
those students who have done it if they are having any confusion related to these first five chapters you can ask me uh, now two minutes are left students those who are doing it do it fastly Saad, have you done it? Yes, teacher. Okay. Do you have any uh, confusion or problem related to first five chapters? No. Maha, do you have any uh, confusion related to first five chapters? No, teacher. Everything is clear. Yes. So, Maha, you are having any problem in, uh, regarding first five chapters? No, teacher. Okay. Have you also completed your all work? Yes. Good. Zoya, do you have any uh, confusion? No. Have you completed all the work till ch uh, chapter number one and till five? Yes. Good, Zoya. I asked Maha, uh, Maha, Samaha, Zoya, who is left. Saad, uh, Saad, you have completed your work. Yes, Azan. Have you? Uh, do you have any confusion related to these chapters? Teacher, no. Have you completed your all work? Teacher, pass me difference. Write. Okay. But uh, in your chapter number one, se leke five, till eight, till ten, jitna kam hai, wo sara complete hai. Teacher. जो आपने चैप्टर नंबर 5 एंड 4 आपने जो क्वेश्चन लिख के दिए है ना वो ना मेरे अंडर में वो मैं अगले पेज पे कर लूंगा ओके बट अजान डू इट फास्टली दानिया नाउ मूविंग फॉरवर्ड टू दानिया हैव यू डन ऑल दिस वर्क यस ऑल द वर्क वाज डन यस फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर 1 टिल 5 यस दानियाल Daniel, firstly tell us only few seconds are left now. Yes, Daniel, have have you done all the work? Yes. There, is there is any confusion, or your concept is cleared? G. Yes. Yes. Yes, Isha. Teacher, you have completed all the work from chapter number one till chapter number five. 